Hello, we are gonna teach you how to make eggnog right now here on my crusty show. Ah, eggnog. A Christmas tradition for years. A lot of people like it. So, we're gonna make it. And today, my daughter Emma's gonna make it. To show you that if a six year old can make eggnog, even you can make eggnog. You ready to make some eggnog? Yes. Okay. Come on up here. You can pull up your stool. This part, to separate, you want to separate the egg whites. No, go ahead and show the bowl, Emma. You're going to toss the um, yolk back and forth, and it'll separate that white out of it. And then you're going to take the yolk, and you're going to put it in a separate bowl. And then, if you accidentally did it without separating it, you can scoop your egg yolk up out of your whites and are you and then you're gonna separate it that way so it's not too late to separate them if you accidentally don't yellows up And then stir the yolks with the sugar. That's a quarter cup of sugar. Mixed in with the egg yolk. There's three egg yolks in here. Once it's done, you're going to add the milk slowly. That's the cream, but that's okay. Let's oh. add the milk over here. Oh my god. That's okay. That looks like milk. It does oil. look like milk, yeah. So I add that in it's and make okay. it no. You can add the cream first or you can add the milk first, but okay. you can add it in a little faster. You find that way. And milk too. Yeah, they thought it was milk too. You are gonna mix that in really, really good. Now we are going to add in the rest of the cream. Wow. Stir that in really good. Stir that in really good. Now we are going to whisk the way egg yolks. And this this part takes probably an adult, well, the kid can do it, but I'm gonna whisk them until there's 
um, peaks till the egg yolks really or egg whites are really fluffy. Okay, um, you're gonna take the egg whites and you're gonna fluff them so they have peaks, so they're frothy and fluffy. Now. Um, as the beginning of the video, there were some egg yolks that I didn't separate right away. That's fine. It's not necessary. It's all going to mix together anyways. But for appearance, if you're doing it in a large bowl like the one we used and there's company coming over, you can fluff the egg whites until like a, uh, like a, until they have peaks, until it's fluffy, almost like a cream. And um, put it on top of your punch bowl. Sprinkle the nutmeg on top. And then you're just, this is what, once you get it, it doesn't get as fluffy when there's egg yolks in them, but you're going to pour that like on top, like, and then um, you're going to use a quarter cup, or sorry, quarter teaspoon, you can put that in, we'll put it in, and then see those peaks that are kind of in there, that the frothy peaks you're going to just kind of fold it in just gently to kind of keep that frothy top and then so you got that frothiness, you got that nutmeg on top. You could put in a ladle. Go. Now you can put the ladle in and serve it. Or put it in a jug. Good. You can refrigerate it, put it in a jug. All right, you want to serve me up some eggnog in a cup? Yep. You want to do a Christmas cup? Yeah. Okay, Wait, I'm here's a reindeer cup. Okay, serve me some eggnog, please. I know in the taste eggnog that we made. It tastes pretty good. I can smell the eggnog from here, the nutmeg. I'm going to try mine too. Oh, It tastes just like the kind, I think it tastes better than the kind at the store. That's good. Now I'm sure some of you watched it and went, ooh, raw egg, eh, no, no. I like my egg sunny side up in the morning. Same thing. Um, if you don't like raw eggs at all, this might not be the thing for you. You know, buy the imitation kind at, at the store. This is a straight up eggnog. This is actually from a Laura Ingalls Wilder book. And this is what they made in the uh, late 1800s, probably before that, as soon as they, uh, it's an old eggnog recipe, but it tastes outstanding. It's great. It's a heck of a lot cheaper than the kind you buy at the store. I could make a whole bunch of this with the ingredients that I have. So there you go. It's eggnog. 